Yo, what's going on, man? Chapter 4, Flicker. I actually don't know how many chapters there are for this game. I want to say... Eight? Pike, nine? It's all on this USB drive. All the evidence you need to That's nail Typhon number. for Gabe's death and plenty more. All right. Bring it with you. I'll meet you in an hour. Oh, Thanks. snap. We getting Talk straight soon. to it. Citizens of Haven Spring, we are live at the Spring Festival. One final reminder to head over to the Lathe Flower Cart and grab a rose before they're gone. At Haven's inaugural Spring Festival, eligible women of good stock and birthing age would offer up roses in order to attract a mate. What can I say? History is weird. Thankfully, we've lost the mating stuff. Okay. But kept the roses. And if you do have a special someone in mind, a rose is a great way to say you care. And an even better way to say, hey, look, a rose. Is this where I Sounds get to choose? Fun. Is giving away a rose something I'd do? Maybe. I can decide downstairs. So are we gonna address the whole yeah, yo, what the are we gonna address now, the whole uh um, the USB stick. Like when she freaked out on Steph and she dipped out and was like, I don't need this. Like, are we gonna address that or <laughs> <laughs> it was a bit awkward. Uh, an unexpected response from her, not gonna lie. I'm thinking this will make an excellent after festival snack. Look like he's already open. Is there anything for me to do here? Leaky. I've been meaning to tell Jed about the sink, but I'm afraid he'll try to teach me how to fix it myself. Traditionally, you give roses to your crush at the spring festival, so... I've never had a girl give me flowers before. I'm sorry. I didn't know really you cared so much about traditional gender roles. I'll get back to my butter churning and doilies. Shut up. You first. I would do anything to put the two of them back together. Alright. Look out the window. Looks like the festival is already in full swing. I'm pretty nervous. Usually when you hear the word festival, you think of like, like the streets filled, right? Like even the festivals that I've seen, like there, there's a lot more than just four people outside. <laughs> I see two right there, one right there, and then like t two more down there. Like goodness gracious, bro, this town is dead. So is this thing just decoration or am I supposed to use it? Gabe's notebook. I'm about ready to start my own list. I've got a lot riding on you. Okay, time to head downstairs. Got the thing. Let me see what type of fits we got. <laughs> a little glizzy on the shirt. <laughs> hmm. All of them have a choker, okay. Is that one leopard print? Yeah, that's insane. A leopard print with a tiger on the shirt. It's like wearing a damn Adidas hat with Nike shoes. That's some shit I do. I guess just keep this one. I don't. I don't know. I don't really like any of these. The world really doesn't deserve Thanor. Alex, don't worry about me. The drive down south with my dad always makes me feel better, and we have a lot of plans for the summer. He said we could go camping and make ultra s'mores. S'mores, but with ice cream on top. Secret family recipe. The LARP was amazing. You are a really good bard, and I hope we can do it again soon. I already have more ideas to fill out your backstory. Banshees. Thank, thanks, Alex. Ethan. So Ethan's gone. Chilling with his papa. I've been playing more these past few weeks than the last few years. Feels nice. I should really head down to the park.
Alexandra the Bard will ride again. I'm gonna try real quick to get a high score, and then if I don't, I'm gonna just go downstairs. <laughs> I knew he was gonna go up. I think I'm dead. Let me try again. Am I finished? Oh, you can kill him. Interesting. I wanna quit. I actually want to quit just based off of that, because that was dumb. That was actually stupid. Fuck you. Mm. Mm, that pissed me off, that pissed me off, that pissed me off. Hold on, I gotta go again. I got to. That actually annoyed the hell out of me, bro. What? What is that? 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 Does she blink? Happy <laughs> first spring fest. Thanks. I need to apologize to you guys. What happened in the apartment? Something really messed me up. These past few weeks, I thought I had a handle on my emotions. But after what happened with Charlotte, It's the same old story. I lose control, and I hurt the people I care about. I'm sorry. Yeah. Fuck that. If anyone needs to apologize, it's me. Ever since we've met, you've been there for me. And then when you're the one struggling, I bail. Not cool. I'm really sorry. Okay. If we're both sorry, does that just cancel everything out? I think so. We're back to normal. Not to spoil the moment, but Typhon blew up their own mind. Why? I don't know yet. But we have all the evidence we need to nail them for Gabe's death. I got a hold of Pike. He'll be here soon. Once he sees what's on that stick, it's over. Wait, for what? Typhon. Hence, I thought we were gonna go down to the station I and give it to him. We've all learned the right to enjoy ourselves a little tonight. The band's coming on soon. You'd better be front and center. I don't see how this could go not wrong. Nice. Who's playing? Local band. You'll love them. I have to run back to the trailer. Go be a normal person for a while. Can't make any promises. Text me when it's ready. If I wanted to give away a rose, Steph and Ryan would definitely be on my list. Obviously, I have to choose. Anyway, time to enjoy the festival. They had a bounce house. What are we looking at here? Thanks for letting us celebrate with you. Steph Ryan, I wanna hear everything. We're at the stage, meet us when you're ready. Ryan? Steph and I want to hear. Was that just now? Uh, okay, well, snap. That actually seems like a pretty big spoiler. That's the first page. Don't care. <laughs> Are you joining us this evening, dear? Yes, this is one party I'm willing to brave. Bad. Nigga. Two faced bitch. Hi, Alex. Wanted to wish you a wonderful spring, first spring festival. Unfortunately, I have to work through it this year, but I really appreciated our conversation earlier today. It was great getting to know you better. Yep, Alex said it. <laughs> hey, how's it coming? 
Good. I'd say the chances of starting a fire are low to medium low. Cool. Yeesh. This thing has seen a few spring festivals. Got a dent in it. Jelly bean lady. Two thirty-three. Two thirty-four. Wait, they got one of them guessing things? Hold on. No. Let me cook up. One. Take one for someone special. Rose acquired. Wish me luck, Rose Cart. This game is so demoralizing. Why do I do this to myself? Hmm. Maybe I can help him somehow. She had the answer. Another year, another prize gift card for yours truly to keep. I'm such a little devil. Really? Come on, jelly bean lady. That's not right. I don't think this thing is checking IDs. Nobody tell Pike. If she's the one with the damn jar, then that means you bought the damn gift card too. So why are you happy about keeping the gift card that you bought? <laughs> Either way, you still spent money, my hey boy. There. Guess the exact number of jelly beans and won a prize. That Only music is loud as hell. The exact number? Is that how this game is supposed to work? <laughs> you can go right after this determined young man. That's not how it worked at night, Carly, bro. Whoever got got the Might closest. Well and be Shut special. up. Let me look at it. This is impossible, right? Guess the number of jelly beans and win a prize. Get out of the way. Let me guess. Another year, another prize so gift I... card for yours truly to keep. Somebody wow. in a little town. This is a beautiful model. Da Dio Rama. Dio Rama. Dio Rama. It happened last year. I would like to guess. <laughs> oh, now I can speak. Hi. Oh, hey. Nice to see you. You're taking this jelly bean thing very seriously. Yeah. Because the prize is a $100 gift card. For what? Chrissy's been all anxious ever since she got lost. So, I thought I could get her a bunch of treats. Mm. Which is really embarrassing, saying it out loud. Not at all. That's sweet. Maybe I can help. Oh, for real? Are you good at this? How many jelly beans do you think there are? Mm. Realistically, it's always more than you think it is. I'd say like 800 or so. Huh. Yeah, could be. Feels like something just changed in that lady by the jar. Maybe I should read her. Wait, what is purple? 800's actually not bad. Hopefully they don't go lower. Oh, I was close? 750? Maybe I should say something. Cause like, it's like, yeah, you can count the surface of the shit, but Sam Puckett- I'm sure Jed's <laughs> around the festival. <laughs> or was Maybe it Freddy? I, I don't know, one of them niggas said you gotta, you gotta account for the volume, bro. You gotta account for like, the, the amount on the inside. Speak. Hey, I've got another guess. Yeah? I think it's closer to 700. Yeah, 700 feels right. But we have to get it exactly. Just felt that lady's heart skip a beat. 
Yo, that's a crazy, yo, that's a crazy power, bro. Hear me. They're really close to 731. Oh, yeah, you're brain Who dead. <laughs> Hell yes. Your secret's mine. Dumb as hell. <laughs> Why would you say it in your brain? Like, why would you even be like, yo, they're getting really close to 731. Like, you could have just been like, they're getting really close. The answer is 731. Don't ask me how. 731 jelly beans. That's... That's correct. Yes! Got it. Thanks so much for your help. You rule. <laughs> no sweat. <laughs> now she's pissed. Best spring fest ever. And so peace returned to the Jelly Bean Kingdom. Who is who thinks in their head like that, bro? Like, come on, man. I can't believe it. How did she know? Just a lifetime of emotional trauma. Got pretty lucky there, didn't you? Super lucky. <laughs> Thanks again. Yeah. Yup. 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 The jelly bean guessing contest has ended. Congratulations to our winner, Hector. Hold the applause. Normally, yes, but we had a perfect guess. Someone actually won this time. Yup, 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 yup. That was fun. Eat my flowers. Probably around 10 or 11 p.m. It's nice to see Jed so in his element. Yo, I'm, I'm not advocating for that kind of drinking, mind you. The niggas in this town is tall, is like, bro. Excuse me. Oh, my fault, OG. Probably. Like, look. Excuse me. Probably around 10 or 11 p.m. Look like a damn child. And he was already the... drunk as a skunk. It's gonna help. Excuse me. Yeah, probably Alex. around 10 or 11 p.m. It's been a hell of a month. And he was already drunk as a skunk. Makes it all worthwhile. And I'm not advocating for that kind of drink. I should tell Mac that I heard the call. He deserves that much, at least. Mac. Oh, the radio he he broadcast at? live. The Black Beast of Audley's Traveling Circus. The crown jewel. Is it just the damn black cat from the fucking... Why did I know? I didn't see it either. I just knew that it was like, bro. Damn black cat from oh, the hi, library or the I record store. You into participating, huh? And they kept it open <laughs> if you ever want to leave. He's actually just participating. I should tell Mac that I heard the call. He deserves that much, at least. I get the feeling she's really enjoying herself. This is awesome. Favorite time of the year, by far. That kind of enthusiasm is infectious, especially for me. I just don't believe people I'm think like that, I'm glad Eleanor made it out to the festival tonight. I'll have to say hello. Eleanor? I see him hauling ass toward the dock, and I get on after him. Because I know what he's aiming for. Did they just disappear? So this is that whole communal gathering thing everyone's always going on about. Yep. I get it. the hell is this song? They're really good at like cinematography though, like when it comes to the camera pans and the lights and all that, I'm like bro, they be, they got it. I guess Riley is feeling sentimental tonight. I just wanted to take a second to say how around. wonderful Haven it really is, is. Nights like this always remind me of how lucky I am to call this place home. No other, no other place will come close. Where is Mac? Or did she say I have to call him? Why would I have, I'm glad I Eleanor get made it out to the festival tonight. I'll have to say hello. Oh, that's Eleanor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, Mr. Lantern. I love what you've done with your bar. So then, where's the after party this year? After party? Come on. Young man like yourself, you must know what the haps is. Honestly, I'm getting pretty bushed. Thinking of calling it a night soon. 
There's no graceful <laughs> way to goodness. sample everything on this table. What is this town coming is there? to? Used to be that the spring festival wasn't complete till everyone was either asleep in the park or in someone else's bed. Sad. God. I just hope Riley is Must doing have been pretty right. wild back in oh, your no. My what happened to Riley? I'm talking is about that Mac? Year. I thought he would have left already. Hi, Eleanor. Good evening, dear. The decorations really turned out beautifully. It must have been a huge amount of work. It's worth it. Hey, so where's Riley? I haven't seen her around. Well, she's got a lot going on right now. I think she'd rather keep to herself tonight. Okay. Okay. That was odd. I wonder if there's something she's not telling so me. So she probably found out on her own or something. Are we drinking with? No. I'm not drinking with your I old ass. Going. I'm not even gonna offer. <laughs> the answer will probably be no anyways, but I'm not I'm not down for that, bro. Even if there's a chance. Why did she just open her phone? Everything set, meet at stage on my way. Oh, okay. Sounds like Ryan is ready for me. You too. I better head back. Poor Riley. Waiting for a bus all alone. But thank God she never found out about my condition. Riley went to the bus stop alone. I wonder why. That's bad. That's bad. Hi, Eleanor. She never Good found evening, out, bro. Dear. I fucked up. I really, man. Doing this takes a certain type of person, and I am not, <laughs> not that as fast. person. Those apples look nasty as hell. <laughs> Putting your whole head, dunking it with your mouth open, getting all that saliva in after the person that just went in. Like, bro, no. I'm good, gangy. Where? Over here. Oh, loser. I heard the call. And I wanted to thank you. I know you tried to do the right thing. So, what now? I'm taking Typhon down. The whole hornet's nest. I'm not betting against you, but in the meantime, they're the only ones cutting checks in town. And I still got plenty of bills to pay. Come on, Mac. Even you're too good to work for them. <laughs> it's always flattering to see how much you care about me. I wouldn't go that far. No wonder you try to break up me and Riley. Ugh. There's the Mac I know. <laughs> I actually don't know him at all. What are we talking about right Take now? Take it easy, dude. <laughs> you too. The hell are we talking about right now, bro? I had like two, three conversations with bro. <clears throat> okay, uh, so there's this young farm maid in the elvish countryside. Thank you, Steph. Find her missing sister. Thanks for helping me find the fun again. Sounds like Ethan wasn't the only one inspired by the LARP today. Who the hell did I unlock dialogue with? Man, Haven really parties at this festival, huh? Those big ass headphones. <laughs> this is for you. Are you serious? Of course I am. Dude. Thank you so much. This totally makes my night. I'm glad. Hey. 
Could we meet up after the show tonight? I actually have some pretty big news to share. She said mysteriously. <laughs> of course. Speaking of, Ryan should be done any minute. Meet me there? Sure. Okay, so I'm meeting at the stage, but I can still talk to either one of them. Maybe it's one of them. Holy fuck. She gave me a rose. Time to step it up, Gingrich. Hope I'm ready for whatever I've started. <laughs> can you hear me? I said, you know what? Never mind. Okay. Let's just do that. Hey. Oh, hey. Just in time. So, who's playing? Yours truly. I guess I fucked up. <laughs> Seriously? That's awesome. Well, wait. Who else? It's gonna be me. On guitar. Steph. Who else is playing? <laughs> I hate you both. We didn't want you to wuss out. I Who said have. anything about wussing out? Nobody, but only because we didn't give you the opportunity. This is gonna be awesome, trust me. Yeah, this whole video is getting chopped. This whole video is getting fried alive by copyright. Um, we've never played together before, and... Uh, anyway... Sorry if this sucks. All right, man. Floor is yours. Let's okay. see what type of what type of theme we going for. All these people come from there was not that many niggas in there yo eleanor <laughs> yo eleanor was trying to get jiggy in the bottom right what the hell all right man i was about to go wrong don't piss me off okay Why is she moving like that? Like a damn ghost or something. Hey, Charlotte. How deep do you think? The lake, I mean. I don't know. I felt horrible this afternoon. I didn't know if I could survive that feeling. But now, it's like when your leg falls asleep 
And even though it's still attached, it's become something other than you. What the hell is she talking about? My whole life, I've always felt so deeply. But maybe this is better? I'm telling you, I took away all her emotion. Like, I, there, there's not just the anger. There has to be some type of, some type of reper repercussions to this. Like, I don't know if I'm sorry or not. I don't know what I did. <laughs> it was bad. <laughs> Mikey. There's no shame in needing to feel numb for however long it lasts. If it gets you through another day. I don't feel ashamed. But I take your point. Thank you. At least I can survive numbness. Good to see you, Alex. Have fun at the festival. What the hell was that in, in, yo, <laughs> what was that encounter, bro? Thanks, uh, you're really amazing. Aw, oh, shucks. Come to meet me on the rooftop. On my rooftop of my building? Sounds like Steph wants to meet me on the rooftop. Okay, I gotta admit, this is a pretty great feeling. Hmm, <laughs> W screenshot, W picture. What are you so happy about? Been a while since We're I've seen you smile geniuses. like that. We've run this cake. shit. Keep flexing, ice cream lady. Ice cream cake. I feel like something clicked as soon as we thought of it. As soon as you thought of it. I can't stop thinking about it. Could we do a castle-shaped cake box? Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna let them have their moment. I'm not gonna say nothing. Um, who? No, Mom, Bro. it's not an emergency. Trust me, I'm fine. I'm genuinely confused on who the it said new dialogue unlocked for. It's just Typhon is not normal. Typhon is really. I made a mistake coming know. here. Get out while you can, dude. You were absolutely marvelous on Why did that? Yo, that made my heart skip a beat. Why did she move like you. that? It was. She was gonna have an aneurysm. <laughs> so. We doing shots tonight or what? Of course. Body shots. Who's going first? Just kidding. <laughs> or am I? <laughs> you better I be better kidding, bitch. Going. What the fuck? <laughs> Yo, you freak ass old lady. Yo, what? Why did she just say that? <laughs> We're just talking about body shots with me and then you... Fucking talking about where's the after party, huh? I know you know. <laughs> you block. Yeah. My ears. Hey, thanks, uh, man. This show rules. It's, uh, it's something. Anyway, I'm Izzy. That's stuff. We're drugstore makeup from Seattle. We've got um, merch. Dude, count me in. I'm dying. Hey, we drew a bigger crowd than drugstore makeup. Why is there like an outline here? What does that mean? Can't do anything with it. It might be a glitch. Hi there. Oh my god. Uh, hi. Can I have your autograph? <laughs> okay. I, I'm, I'm serious. <laughs> okay. <laughs> oh, uh, sure. Find me later, alright? Awesome. Th thank you so much. Holy shit. Holy shit. She actually spoke to me. Okay. I'm flattered. Yo, how do niggas actually be moving like this in real life, bro? Like, <laughs> that was the first time I've ever performed I'm anything. Close. That's a first. She's starstruck. wasn't even that good. <laughs> and I'm not being a hater. It was, it was alright, bro. It was, it was cool. A little festival. 
Do I have to find the pen and paper? Excuse me. And the poor That was one hell of a performance. Thanks. It's been a hell of a month. Yep, yep. But this makes it all worthwhile. Should I not have worn cologne? Is that too try hard? Maybe I didn't wear enough. Or maybe it's the total lack of saying anything. Trying to smell good does not try hard, my boy. Crap. Was I supposed to give him a hug? Does he think that I think it's not a date? Aww. I'll get the hang of this one day, or not. <laughs> I can't save everybody, man. Grand opening tomorrow. I'll take a coupon. No coupons, my dear. Just <laughs> tell me your name and I'll remember it. All right. Alex Chen. Alex Chen. Didn't we speak already tonight? Nope. Stupid, so stupid. Print some coupons, they said. It's a small town, I'll remember, I said. Oh, hubris. You know, you could try posting on my block. Whoever comments gets the deal. Oh. Well, that's a good idea. Goofy Best off. of luck. Gotta pull my shit together for this grand <laughs> opening. These people won't be so gracious forever. <laughs> we might. Free food goes a long way in Haven. Nice. May the best small town diner win. Brown Bear Diner. Who's that? Is this the angry bald guy? Serious right now. <laughs> His guy. Yes. A fucking. Too bad I can't unlock doors with my emotions. <laughs> Oh, yeah, he's gonna be tight. So I can't park where I normally park because we have to celebrate a bunch of fucking flowers. Hey, boot! Fuck you! You think you're making the you're world a better place? Think you're doing a service for the citizens? You're just a goddamn tool for the man! You're a cog in the machine, you metal fuck! He sounds like a me canyon voice actor. Okay, Chris Angel. Let that let that go. One, two, three. I control me. One, two, fuck! I don't control shit! Oof, sorry, man. We've all been there. I swear, boy, angry bald man's gonna be the main villain of this damn game. There's still a decent crowd milling around tonight. There's still a decent crowd milling around tonight. What does that mean? The LARP was Stage a lot reverse. of fun. Yeah, it was. Do you think there's food left at the festival? Are you hungry? I thought you might be. I could be. But are you? Not really. But that's nice of you. Right. Cool. God, I still like her so much. What do I do? Sorry, man. Forbidden love is a bitch. Stop being friends, my guy. Simple as that. Damn it. I'm head over heels for this dork. What do I do? Wait. They're both into what? each other. <laughs> Come on, people. Ain't why is she mad about it? Wait, wait. wait. Ain't this the same couple that I saw Sorry. in the beginning of the damn game talking about if we're just friends? What do I? What are we talking about? I think this is weird, bro. I have a surprise for you. Good surprise or bad surprise? Bro, I thought he was a crackhead I talking to me. A farm in Moondrop Ranch. Get out! I didn't expect that him playing my favorite game would be a turn on, but here we are. I don't even have a response to that. Like, uh, just showing interest in There's something still a that you crowd like. Milling around tonight. What does that mean, Alex? What am I supposed to do with this with this information that you keep telling me? What about acute emotional kleptomania? Yeah, whatever the hell she just said. Jed bought this as a treat for the regulars. And himself. 
Um, it was so fun watching Jed play the villain. What a good sport. It was tough, I ain't gonna lie. Eleanor is like a mafia boss. Except instead of crime, she spreads flowers. Looks like a fun night. <laughs> Does it? <laughs> Come on, son, get it over with. 21. I, I don't want to get sick. You're going to feel a whole lot better after you do. <laughs> I'm going to die, Dad. Not tonight, you're not, birthday boy. Although I suspect you're going to wish you had tomorrow morning. Bro, I was literally about to say, y'all better not have no nigga throwing up in my ear. Why the hell are you in here, dog? You scared the shit out of me. I thought he was a statue. <laughs> Bro, what was I saying? Um, why is dude's voice way more high pitch at 21? That's not how that works, buddy. Hey, Ducky. Evening, Alex. Everything okay? Well, I'm fine. Thank you. You know the bar's closed, right? Oh? So it is. It's not the same without you, Tabitha. Never was, never will be. Tabitha, sounds like Ducky's got a story to tell. Hey, Ducky, who's Tabitha? Do you want to talk about her? You know, Alex, on this particular matter, I don't have much to say. Okay. There's got to be more I can do for Ducky. How would I even know? Like, he didn't even question how I know who that is. Okay. Tell me what I need to know to help him. Is that a dart on its nose? You know, I carved that myself. Oh, hi, I'm Reginald McAllister III. My friends call me Ducky. <laughs> Tabitha Baker. Call me Tabs. Tabs. I'm gonna take any guesses. She either died or she left him. I'm gonna say she passed. Most likely. Wait, don't drink it. Look at the bottom. What? What are you... Uh, oh, Ducky. It's beautiful. Tabitha Baker. Will you marry me? <laughs> get her with the... How did that get in there? Some Tobey Maguire shit. Tough. Happy anniversary, love. Here's to another 30 years. And another 30 festivals, if we can make it. Ducky, you're gonna outlast this whole damn town. I know that song. Poor Ducky. Maybe there's something I can do. What could I possibly do? Play the song? Can I play the song? That may Bro, I feel like that would make him feel worse. Happy anniversary, love. Here's to another 30 years. And another 30 festivals. If we you didn't have to show me this again. <laughs> You're gonna I thought it was giving me the, app, the option town. to turn the damn thing on. Hey, bro, if you... If someone that you love passed away and y'all had a song and then that song randomly comes on when you're thinking about them, I don't think, I don't know if you're going to feel better. You're like, you might just 
burst into tears, my boy. It's a tough night for you, isn't it? The Spring Fest? That's right. Dance. Down with the Spring Festival wooden bear. Are these options? Because the wooden bear has a damn question mark. Give me one sec. Alright. They don't make these options clear when it comes to helping. It's like, bro, the fact that there's a question mark. <laughs> Why would I click that? I feel like I'm gonna fuck up the whole game. <laughs> How did you? They're playing your song. Let's dance. I don't know this song, but I can appreciate its vibe. Yo, this song fire. Bro, if you grew up watching Tom and Jerry, like, you gotta have some level of appreciation for music like this. Especially the Christmas specials back then. Oh my goodness, man. You know what reminds me most of her right now? It's not the song or the festival. It's that you took the time to care about a sad old man for no other reason than to make the world a little less troublesome. And that was Tabs. Thank you, Alex. I think I'm a little more inclined to join the others outside. You're very welcome. Enjoy the festival. Nice. Ugh. Not tonight. <laughs> All right. We done helped everybody that needs to be helped. <laughs> Captain save a hole right here. Now it's time to go get some cheeks. Uh, you said you have some news? I'm leaving. I'm actually leaving Haven Springs. Can you believe it? Back on the road again. Fucking finally. Wait, seriously? I'm gonna play music again, Alex. Anywhere I want. God, I forgot how fucking good it feels. <sighs> this sucks. Okay. Holy shit, Steph. That's so cool. I'm really happy for you. You better keep in touch. You think it's that easy to get rid of me? Come on, Chen. I need a new destination. <sighs> You're my good luck charm. You have shit taste in good luck charms. <laughs> Shut up. Pick one. Massachusetts Salem. Yeah, right. Can you get fucking witch curses on your ass? Uh, the middle of the ocean. Or Berlin... What are these options? <laughs> it sucks. Wish you were here. 
the fact that she literally dressed up as a witch for that whole LARP thing, I'm gonna just say that one. Salem, Halloween capital of the world. Or so they say. <laughs> Who do I hang out with? Massholes. You join a coven. A lesbian coven. Is there any other kind? <laughs> you hang out in graveyards and perform rituals to speak to the dead. None of which ever work, but that's okay. Because I get a load of old tombstone rubbings to decorate my apartment with. That sounds like a pretty spectacular plan. <laughs> Does it? Great. You hesitated. Then come with me. Oh yeah, you're wildin'. To Salem? Sure, why yeah, not? Yeah, I just got here. Doesn't have to be our first stop, but one day. I still have friends in Seattle who book shows. Maybe we start there, or I don't know, Kansas City, Vegas, wherever we want. Look, I don't want to pressure you, but I've seen you give so much of yourself to make sure other people get what they need. And I guess I wonder if you've thought about what you need. I mean, obviously, I like you a lot. Alex. You mean the fucking world to me. Damn. Like that? <laughs> Get ready to do it then, my boy. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Kiss me. Be in there. Got him. I guess Alex is just short. <laughs> she had to go out and take those. <laughs> Compared to everybody else in this damn town. Whoa. You just light up the whole damn sky like that? I guess that is what it feels like. <laughs> Probably nothing changed around them, you don't but have to that's just how they, they, should, they perceived okay. it. Just think about it. I will. Thank you. I'm gonna head back down. Find me later. So, I mean, we already know that something bad has to happen. One bad thing always has to happen, at least in every chapter, right? So when are we going to get to it, all right? When are we going to cut the BS? Hey, Gabe. Can I tell you something? I think I solved it. Why you died. Who's responsible? Isn't that crazy? I'm out of threads to pull, which is terrifying. Because on the other side of all this, after Typhon, after you, there's just normal life. I was kind of counting on you to show me how to do that. But I think I can figure it out. I just wish you were here to see it. The Black Lantern. Alex. 
You have the USB drive? I do. It's all here. Gabe's call, their secret plan, the cover-up. Somebody you need to come with me to the station. I knew it. Alex? Don't make this hard. I knew it. I knew it. You niggas think you're so slick. You niggas think that y'all are on timing. Y'all think that y'all are smart. You're not. Alright, I saw it. I saw it coming from like literally 18 million miles away. Fuck is niggas talking about? Is it the fact that- wait, 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 Alex. Do not tell me that you told this nigga where you got it from. If you, if, yo, 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 if she told him, or if this nigga somehow found out how we got it, it's GG's. Because you can't use evidence that you weren't, like, you can't steal the shit and then use it as evidence. Like, that just, you can't, it just doesn't work like that. You aren't allowed to. I forget what the thing is called. Probably isn't how you... Pictured your first spring festival, huh? Not exactly. Coffee? Sit so your eyes down, Pike. I'm alright. Thanks, so. though. Good. Because we're, uh, actually out. It's literally the end of the night. Why would I want coffee to stay up? Pike, why am I here? <laughs> The long and short of it is, I knew it, yo. Diane is fucking losers. A USB drive. What the hell are you talking about? Yo. Did you steal this USB drive or not? At least tell me you looked at it. I can't. Sorry. Yo, these niggas did not use their brain. These niggas did not use their fucking brain. I, like, why did they just... Bro, I... That, <laughs> that's not even something that i would fuck up like that's not even like bro i don't even be thinking ahead too too far but bro i wouldn't have even messed that up i would have copied the damn drive and then like snuck it back to her some shit put it in the lost and found not used her exact drive to give to him like that's insane that is insane you're conducting an investigation into typhon right Everything you've been looking for is on that drive. Despite my best efforts, the case is closed. The order came down today. I did what I could, but you know, the evidence just wasn't there. Sorry, Alex. The order came down today. From who? High up. Bosses, bosses, boss. It's not my job to know. Look, what happened to my brother wasn't an accident. It was criminal. The files on that drive prove it. That could be true. But let's say it is. The issue is... You stole Typhon's property. I can't work with that. Okay, I get the point. I'm sorry I stole the drive, but... Apologizing isn't enough. Yeah, that's just not how that works, Alex. Alex you fucking... You're not thinking about this clearly. <laughs> Seems pretty clear to me. Diane wants to charge you with computer fraud. That's a federal crime, Alex. Five to ten, easy. That's tough.
You're telling me I might go to prison for this? For five to ten years? It's not that bad. Hey, I talked to her, and despite how angry she is at everything you did, she's willing to let it go. Oh, yeah? Is she willing? How nice of her. It's not like, you know what I'm saying? She's covering up a nigga's death or nothing. Yeah, I'll spit in that bitch's face. I'll take the 10 years. I don't Typhoon give a fuck. What is she charges. talking about? I'm afraid I didn't hear what he just said. <laughs> Does this mean she's guilty? Why would she do that? She just wants this whole thing to go away. This is how to make that happen. Fuck that. I'm not signing anything. Alex. No. Typhon buried something in the mountains. Something so massive they ignored Gabe's call and set off the blast just to cover it up. Don't you want to know what it is? What do you mean, cover it up? Another blast, unannounced, set off at the exact same time at the old mining site. And all of it happened just a few weeks before inspections were set to begin. Why does Nigga look like he knows Come something? On, Pike. It's all right here. Like I said, it doesn't matter. Alex, please, just sign the form, and we can both go back to the party. No. Alex, this is not an offer that you can choose. I said no. No is not an option. What are you so scared of? Read this again, find out. See for yourself. Shit. What could be in that envelope? Threat evaluation subject. Died in an accident related. Intel shows subject has a high level of determination and efficacy. Negative affectation. Affectation has persisted beyond predicted bereavement period. Suspect also appears to have possession of confidential data and information. Threat priority one immediate action required. Do you think is <laughs> are they planning on assassinating? Wait. Began following subject after meeting with Mac. Subject met with man identified as Ryan. Little else of note. Spent three hours in apartment. Wi-Fi. Yeah, they got a fucking private investigator on my ass. Typhon's history and legal records. Appears a stolen an object from the client. Niggas was watching me the whole time. That's tough. Uh, assisting Alexandra Chen with her efforts against Typhon involved in an extremely distraught over accident. Subject has high level of knowledge of both geography and residents of Haven. Staff assisting. Wait, 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 wait. Ryan Steph. Oh, shit. Is this a threat? What did you expect? Huh? The Typhon, a global organization with billions in revenue, an army of lawyers, and who knows how many politicians in their pockets would just what, throw up their hands and say, you got us. I thought I could get justice for Gabe. Yeah, well, 
Typhon has their own idea of justice. I didn't know they was Shit. they was in deep like that. I thought this was like a a town company, like a town, like you know what I'm saying. Like, I didn't know this was Nothing billions. Of, like, yeah, you're kind of you kind of fucked. I've learned the hard way that it's not possible. They're too big, too connected, too ruthless. You can hate me if you want. Call me a coward. But I don't want to lose you like we lost Gabe. I Who in real Typhon. life is like this? I bet if I took his fear away. I don't think we can do that again. But it's not just about me. Steph and Ryan are in danger too. Fuck. I want to hurt Typhon so bad. But can I really put their lives at risk along with mine? I forget who it is in real life. There's a there's a studio company. I, it might be. It can't be Disney, can it? I don't know. Somebody hired Pinkertons and is still hiring them niggas to this day. And like they're like private. They they'll actually send niggas to your crib if you try and leak any of their shit and have you shot the fuck up. They're like like they they they're in deep, bro. What is this going to do, bro? Do you want to risk your life? I think it's Hasbro's. Gabe, Mac, Alex. Who's next? Fuck. 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 Just keep your head down, dude. You're just a shit heel. Typhon's major league. Typhon doesn't lose. Typhon disappears, people. Let them get killed. Not you. I know you're afraid. I am too. I know you think that Typhon is too big, too invincible, but they're not. I will bring them down. I just need your help. If not for me, then for Gabe. Please. Fuck. I'll think about it. Thank you. There's literally no way to get through this because if they're watching like your search it. history, and seeing that these really? niggas can see what you're downloading and shit, like, bro, that's crazy. You gotta Alex. fucking go off the grid. Be careful. Yeah, I'm gonna open this door and get sniped in the forehead. Yeah, I think it was Hasbro's. Like, they had sent a nigga unreleased toys or something, and they hired Pinkertons to to pull up on into his house and take it and raid his shit. Because they, they take it serious. Come see me when you get the chance, Jed. The Black Lantern Tavern. There's always a corkage fee. Jed. Those pictures. How long have they been watching us? And what will they do if? <sighs> All right, gonna have an anxiety attack. I have no idea what to do next. You need to close the damn shades. Maybe talking to Jed will help me feel better. <laughs> they are watching, buddy.
First, I need to get out of this dress. It was special for me too, Steph. Enjoy that ice cream. I finally grew a pair and told a very special girl how I feel, how special she is. And the scariest part wasn't telling her, it was realizing how dumb I was for waiting. I'm glad Ducky had a nice night. He deserves it. Looks like I'm on my own now. I don't want to drag Ryan and Steph in any deeper. Can't wait to have nightmares tonight. <laughs> What time is it, bro? Might as well go talk to Jed now. What if he gets sniped while I'm talking to him? We shall see. Hey, Jed. There she is. Have a seat. Something tells me you've had a more exciting spring festival than you planned for. <laughs> you saw Pike arrest me. Oh. And let you go, apparently. Then there's that business with Ryan and Steph earlier today. I wasn't sure why it took all three of you to work out Diane's lunch order. I know you're used to looking out for yourself. Gabe was like that. But Haven's a community. We help each other. I want to help you. But first, you have to let me know what's going on. I don't think we need to get anybody else involved in here. What have I got to lose? <sighs> These are ass options. Okay, I have no choice but to say at least one of these. The hell is he gonna do with the information of them threatening Ryan? Typhon killed Gabe. I have proof. What proof? I stole it from Diane. Emails and documents proving there was a second explosion the night Gabe died. To cover something up, He's Jed. He's gonna get sniped, bro. <laughs> Some secret. He's gonna theory. get sniped, bro. We're telling way too many people. I don't know what it is. I don't even know what to do next. But I'm not giving up. Not ever. I know what they're hiding. Please, Jed. What's the truth? What are they afraid of? Typhon's the devil that runs this town. I've been carrying their secrets for far too long. I'm guessing, yeah, because I he... know what they buried in the mountains. It was the bodies Tell that me. he saved, or the people that I'll he saved? I'll do one better. I'll show you. 
something is wrong here bro something is wrong here bro I, I like we're getting too much information at the same time as like niggas yeah. finding stuff yeah. out al about us so i i just don't believe like niggas finna get his head blown the fuck Middle off of like nowhere. we definitely got followed here about two clicks that way is the mining site where you search for ethan five clicks that way is town What is this thing? Ventilation shaft. They're scattered everywhere. Over the years, mines grow into mines, creating a labyrinth under Haven. What you're searching for is down below. Set up, 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 set up. Set up, 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 set up of hell. Bro. I'm sorry, kid. Okay. Just put the gun down. It was him. He was the one watching. I knew it was like... I tried to talk you out of it scare you off i was sure those pictures of ryan and steph would do the trick but you were relentless won't leave damn well enough alone sick is literally the villain of fucking toy story 12 years ago i made a mistake the kind of thing that you you can't undo but typhon made me a deal way to save my town give my boy a normal life I never wanted Gabe to get hurt go to hell <laughs> holy shit Like, what did I say, bro? These niggas are the most predictable fucking pattern having ass. Like, oh my god. We had a whole chapter of just partying, fucking niggas talking, chopping it up. People, it was too, there was too much wholesomeness for there not to have a messed up ending. Like, like it's the same thing every single time with this game. Every single time. So what if I signed the thing and then just decided I'm not gonna abide by it? Are you fucking kidding? Yo, these niggas is trying to piss me off with the whole storyline going on with Ryan. Riley, what do you mean she was at the bus stop? There was no bus stop. Nigga, I walked around the entire area. Riley went away to college. Alex revealed Eleanor's illness and Riley stayed. Riley had decided not to go to school. Alex didn't find Riley. Most people didn't even find the bitch. Like, yo. Oh my God. That actually just triggered the hell out of me. That actually just triggered me, bro. What are we talking about? That is actually so annoying. I sold. I sold twice now. There was no bus stop, bro. I walked around the entire area. What are we talking about? It had to have been back in the beginning of the fucking game where I first showed up. Because there's no... There is... No, bro. There was nowhere else to look. I'm so disgusted. This nigga dead just shot me in my face. I wanna... Yo, I wanna... Man... Alright, man, that's it. That's it for this episode. I'm pissed. <laughs> Not only did I call that fucked up ending, 
but I missed out on the whole Riley situation. Like, that is so annoying, bro. I'm supposed to be him when it comes to finding each and every single situation, interaction to, like, encounter, whatever the hell. And I'm here I am sitting with the majority of 54% of niggas that didn't even go down there. Didn't even know Riley left, bro. She's gone. Never gonna see her again for the rest of the fucking game. <laughs> Uh, it's so annoying, but it is what it is, man. Y'all let me know what y'all thought of this chapter. If you enjoyed, feel free to leave a like, and I shall see you all in the next one.